Colin Firth wrote to his wife's lover to sympathize with him after she called off their affair, the jilted Italian journalist Marco Brancaccia has claimed Marco, who knew Livia Giugioli since she was a teenager, had a fling with the actress while she was separated from Colin in the summer of 2015, which ended 11 months later Last week it came to light that Marco accused of stalking the married couple with a series of telephone calls and texts had actually been romantically involved with Livia He alleges that at the time, Livia had wanted a divorce from her famous husband. NOW Marco claims Colin wrote to him to sympathize with the pain he felt after Marco allegedly emailed Colin pictures of his wife You have made me suffer, but I know you are suffering too, the message reportedly said Marco told the Daily Mail the Firth's accusations he had stalked them were rubbish, adding that this is a case of a famous couple trying to cover up her love affair He said, I fell in love completely with Livia. I felt she was the woman of my life I loved her very much, very much. In an unprecedented move, Colin and Livia's rep last week confirmed their marriage had come under strain when Livia strayed A few years ago Colin and Livia privately made the decision to separate During that time Livia briefly became involved with former friend Mr. Brancaccia The Firths have since reunited, said their spokesman. Subsequently, Mr. Brancaccia carried out a frightening campaign of harassment over several months, much of which is documented. For obvious reasons, the Firths have never had any desire to make this matter public, the statement added. Marco denied the claims he was stalking the Hollywood couple, adding, My stalking consisted of two messages via WhatsApp after she ended our relationship in June 2016 and an email He told The Sun that police have seized his phone and computer amid reports Italian prosecutors have asked for the case against Marco to go to court Of the latest claims that Colin had written to Marco, Colin's rep said, This is an ongoing criminal prosecution, and it would be inappropriate to comment in this circumstance Meanwhile, a previous interview has come to light revealing the close friendship between Colin and Amanda Seyfried, then 22, when they worked together The 57-year-old double Oscar winner made such an impression on his young co-star while they were filming Mamma Mia that she chose to immortalize her memories of him with a tattoo Amanda, who played Colin's teenage daughter in the 2008 box office hit, revealed that she found him very sexy and has the word minge tattooed on her foot because of him Colin Firth used to say that word on set and Rachel McDowell had to explain to me what it meant, she said in 2010 